get going. All right, guys, so my name is Megan. I am a Legree and Row former instructor out in Orange County, California. I teach at Trim Fitness and I teach at Hard Fit. Um, and this morning I am teaching wherever you are. Uh, I am going to go over our equipment that we're going to be using today and then I'm going to go ahead and get us started. 45 minutes, it's going to be a low impact, high intensity workout. Um, and if you got those ankle weights, um, you, go, you can go ahead and strap those on right now. If you don't, no worries at all. But just as I'm queuing into this, working with this here, I'm going to grab those ankle weights because we are going to use them for our very first section of class. So as you're strapping on those ankle weights, working with it here, um, other items, other things you're gonna want to have with you is going to be those discs, those sliders, something that moves across the floor surface, whatever you're on. If you're on hardwood, you're looking for like washcloths, uh, like towels, fuzzy socks, something like that, or tile. Um, and then uh, if you're on carpet, you're looking for something like a little bit more slick side. So it can be like the top of a tub or a cap, a frisbee. It can be, um, you know, a paper plate. You've seen lots of options. Um, these are the TZ Sport. I actually just got ordered them like last Thursday and they got here within like two days from Amazon. And they came with like a fabric an adjustable fabric brand that actually works pretty well. I'll share that with you guys later today because I wanted to test them out before I said anything, um, but I actually do like them. They actually work, so, you know, Amazon, right? Okay, so ankle weights are going on. We're also gonna go ahead and have that heavier, thicker resistance band. This is going to be your something that's gonna take a little bit harder, like, I'm trying really hard to pull this out right now and it's not going past my shoulders. Um, so that's what you're looking for. It's just a little bit tighter for our legs. Um, that medium resistance band, you'll see me, I'm going to be using this for pretty much all the majority of um, our arms section for us today here. And last but not least, we got that lighter resistance band right here. You can always, always do, use everything with a set of hand weights. So if you got a set of hand weights instead, um, but do grab that light resistance band. We do have a super lunge um, in our uh, little sequence here today. So if you know what I'm talking about, you know where we're going. Uh, other than that, towel, water, and we will get those bodies moving Tuesday. So ankle weights are on for our first ab section. We're gonna target into the low abs, we're gonna target with the core, and we're just gonna start lying on our back. So nice and simple, you're gonna lie and we're gonna go into an upside down plank position. I'm gonna turn the music up just a little bit right here. Get our timer, get everything set. Meet me lying onto that back and bring those discs somewhere close with you because we're gonna go into them pretty quickly here. All right, we get ready. Take it on back. Tuesday, deep breath in. Whoo, let's go. Okay, take it all the way back for me right here. I'm gonna slide away from you a little bit. Lie it onto that back. Take it into an upside down plank position. So what that means is I literally want you to think about being in a plank. Push the heels out and away. Squeeze the inner thighs in. Roll the shoulders out and the ears. Get the tuck, squeeze the low abs. Pull the belly button back to the spine. Take the arms up like we're pushing up the ceiling. Push it away, hold right there. Get the chin off the chest. Reach the neck long. Holding on to this right here. Good, you guys. We got just 15 seconds to hold, to squeeze right here. Those ankle weights start to get heavy, pulling into those low abs. Take your gaze up to the ceiling. I want you to look just past those fingertips. We get ready. Those hands stay tall. Knees slowly drag in. We're going upside down there in three, two, one. Bend those knees in. Slowly take them in. Stop before they come in front of the hips. Then take them right back out. Reach, reach. As you send them out, you get right back to that upside down plank where you were, and then tuck it in. Squeeze. Shoulder blades off the ground. Level two right there. Level one, you can leave those shoulder blades down. Holding into this right here, give it that same tuck. Again, stop the knees before the hips, otherwise we're up. Pull into this here. Good, you guys. So I like to almost mimic my hands, feeling like they're pushing up and away. It helps my shoulder blades to come up and get off the floor because I can feel that tuck, that squeeze when that belly buttons into the spine. We're just 30 seconds in right here, but that breath is already starting to change. We now have to be intentional about it. Inhale out, exhale, pull it in. 
Get that mind right right here. It's 45 minutes for you and your body. Lock into it, last eight. Good, you guys. We got this here, we get ready. We're gonna go ahead, lie that back flat down. We're coming into a catfish. Come up in soft bend in the knees in three, two, one. Hold it, soft bend. Now, without moving that torso at all, we're just gonna reach out six to eight inches. Slowly take it up, stop the knees. There's just this small, small area. So, a catfish is this point where we're actually usually on those hands pushing away and then you're dragging the carriage in just a few inches. I want you to visualize those low abs doing the work. You're scooping in. So inhale, out right there. Now scoop, scoop, pull, place. Feel the low back get heavy. Drive through the floor. Good, you guys, right here. Take those hands up. Whoo, 15 seconds right here, squeeze. Good, do not let that low back peel off the floor. If you absolutely need that assistance, you can place those hands lightly underneath those hips. Otherwise, I want you to use that core, feel it scoop in, hold that tabletop. Last eight, there you go. Breathing through this here, this one, we got little one inch pulses. We're gonna take one leg at a time. Hold it out in four, hold it out in three, two, hold it. Now take your left foot down an inch. Bring your right foot to meet it. Take your left foot up an inch. Bring your right foot to meet it. This time right leg, go right leg, down left. Up right, up left, switch it. So every time you're alternating, which leg leads the way? Whew. Feel those abs start to shake, start to get that resistance right here. Breathe into it. Yes, you can. Good, you guys. You got this right here. We get ready in six. We're going to flip it on over. We're going on to those toes. Whew. We're going to hit that same movement, that same work that you just did. We started with that bear. This time, we take that bear on those discs. Meet me in that plank. In three, two, one. Okay, so high plank position right here. Both feet come on to one disc or alternating one or the other. You take yourself into that plank, you meet me there. So, level one, right here, you're gonna go right, take it back out. Squeeze in left, take it back out. But either way, it's slow, that bear is with both right here. So if you're taking that all the way into that bear, let's go. Four, three, two, hold, hover the knees, flat table, tap. There you go, take it out, reach long, scoop it back and in. Breathe, breathe, hover, hold, take it out, reach. Push those heels all the way back, squeeze, keep your low abs tucked up and in. Push away with those hands, yes you can, that chin is off that chest. You got that flat tabletop spine. Push the heels away from you as you reach long. Do not let those hips drop in. Good, you guys, you got this here. We got 15 seconds left onto that bear. I want you to get that mind focused in for me right here. If you haven't already, pick a word, pick a phrase. I like to ask this classes. I like to ask you to challenge you to pick something that's gonna be your mantra this morning, your mantra for this workout, so that every time it starts to get challenging, you go back to that why, that reason, that purpose. Let's go. Pull through it. Last six. Hold it out. Meet me in that high plank. Hold it there in three, two. Hold it there, hold it there. Stay there, shoulders out of the ears, core and tight. Good, you guys, we started in that upside down plank. We're finishing in this plank right here. You push everything up and away. Squeeze into it, I want those abs to fight, to breathe. Whoo, here we go. 25 seconds, stay onto that. Use that core right here, breathe it out. Good, you guys, the shoulders stay back and out of the ears. You squeeze everything up and in. Do not let those hips drop. Scoop them up, pull them in. You know what to do, push through those hands. You got just another eight seconds. Right here, so strong. Good, you guys, you got this here, we get ready. We're gonna go ahead, coming up, we go right into that escalator lunge, that right foot, left foot, sorry, left foot's coming forward. We're gonna take off that resistance, that um, ankle weight in four, in three, two, one, let's go. Okay, quick transition, ankle weights are off. Pop them up, squeeze in here. You got that option to leave them on if you want that added challenge. But an escalator lunge, we're coming down. Meet me at the bottom. I want you to find that hamstring, 
pull back, squeeze, lift, stop well before you come to the top, take it right back out and away. So that left foot's forward, hips are squared. Come all the way down, hold. Now, escalator means that this is the one on the moving platform. This is the one we're pulling back underneath, squeezing, coming into it here. So your chest is a little bit higher because you're not stepping over. You're not pressing down through the front foot. You're actually pulling through that heel. Pull it back, pull it back, squeeze. You almost feel the knee come right over that heel. So it's like my knee starts over the center of that foot as I come down low but I can feel as soon as I activate through that heel, it stacks, pulls, and activates through the back of the hamstring. Squeeze the inner thighs towards each other. There you go, keep that back toe light. You got 15 seconds left of this full range. We're gonna get into those challenges nice and quick. So when I say a challenge, that's gonna be where we're gonna isolate that muscle even more. We've already taken all the focus into that left leg for me here this morning, but right now in six, I want you to come down low. We got three inches here Tuesday. Come on in three, two, hold it at your lowest, hands to prayer. Now when I say three inches, we're gonna climb one inch at a time. You're gonna squeeze, come up an inch, and do it again, two more times. Let's go, squeeze up an inch, hold. That's one, two more, push it up, two. Push it up, three, stop there, right back down, three. Back down, two, that left leg, that left heel. Be so cautious that that knee is not coming in front of that toe. These are small, slow little pulses. I always like to say that you're grabbing a fist with that muscle that's working. Squeeze it, pulse it like you're clenching that fist right here. Pull it up, take it right back, reach. Squeeze your inner thighs in to protect those joints, protect those knees. Good, you guys, you got just 10 little inches. Stay into it right here. I know it's already firing up everything into that left leg. That's where we want it this morning. Good, you guys, you got this for eight. Woo. Check it out. We get ready in three, full range in two, one. Drag through. Remember, pull through that front left leg. Woo. Use that hamstring. Inhale, take it down. Squeeze it out. Breathe it right there. Hold. Take it up for four, three, two. Pause, take it down. Give me two more, just like that. Crazy slow, just like that. Holding into it here. Woo. Pull it back, squeeze, squeeze, draw through this right here. Good, you guys, you're in that escalator. You do not lock out that front left leg. Keep that constant pull. Remember, scrape it like you're getting shoe off, gum off the bottom of your shoe. Pull it back underneath you. There we go, meet me down in four. Meet me down, hold. In three, two, hold it here. Hold it here, stay there. We got a 30 second moonwalker. In three, two, one, pull it in, in. Bend that back knee, drop it down an inch. Take it out for four, three, two. Drop it down an inch, do it again. Squeeze, squeeze. Drop it down an inch, push it back. Good, you guys, right here, one more. Drop it down an inch, hold it in, hold. Just breathe, first six. Good, you guys, you're gonna send it all the way out. Climb it up to the top, nice and slow. We go standing in our thighs from here, get ready. Push it out. Two, three, hold, climb it up. Four, three, two, find that second disc right here. Okay, guys, both feet onto those discs. Take the feet wide, extend it, squeeze it in. Pull those inner thighs in. You got just a 60 second inner thigh section right here. This is gonna be that quick little recovery. Ooh, that reset. You can do this one leg at a time. So level one, kick it out, side, side, side. It's like you're doing like a side skating right here, but you're still using those inner thighs. Level two, both out. Reach it out, turn the toes out just slightly, squeeze. It's kind of like we're making snow angels in really thick snow. Pull it out. Woo. Squeeze, drag through those inner thighs. Let's go. Breathe. Inhale. Exhale. Pull, 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 pull. Squeeze. Feel the abs. Pull those inner thighs. Here we go. 20 seconds right here. Breathe. Take it in. Right back out. There we go. Hanging on to it. Take it up. Woo. Squeeze it right here. Reach it out. Good, you guys. You got this right here. 
Keep powering through this right here. We get ready. Woo. In six. We're going to find that heavy resistance band. I want you to meet me for skating. Get ready. Heavy resistance band around in three. Left leg is working in two. One. Let's go. So keep the disc underneath the right. Take that heavy resistance band. Place it around the outside of the quads. Left foot's on that mount. Right foot is onto the disc. Squat down, hold low. Squat first. Think about sitting down into that invisible chair. Roll the heels back. Now anchor down through the outside of that left heel. That's your gas pedal. Push it out. Two, three, hold, pull it back in just as slow. There you go, right here. Come on, stop that knee before the hip. Push it right back out. Push it out, reach four. Three, two, hold. So this is the first time. This is our first static hold for this left leg. It's gonna be our only static hold for this left leg where we challenge that fight, that squeeze to hold everything down, hold it low into that left leg where its main job is to anchor down through the ninth edge of that foot. Hold it, stack the shoulder, hip, knee, toe, push it out. Drive, reach, that right foot is light. That right foot is just enough to drag that disc in and out. Everything else is coming from that push, that standing leg right here. Keep that core up and away, drop it down, push it out. Flat spine, reach each vertebrae, pull them out and away from each other. Good, you guys, you got this here. We're just 10 seconds away from that challenge, that push. Hanging into this one right here, you get ready. Hold it halfway for me. In four, three, Two, hold, two inches, down one. Out one, hold, come on. Down one, out two, hold, two inches here, in one. In two, hang on to it, out one, out two. Woo. Let it start to shake, let it start to squeeze right here, come on. Give it that fight, give it that push. Little inches, you got this right here. This is our only movement with that thick band, with that heavy, that heavy tension. We get ready in six, go back full range in three, two, one. All right, 20 seconds of full range. Come on, all the way out, drive into it. We're going into a full body movement from here. We're going into that super lunge. I want you to start thinking right now, where is that light resistance band? It's gonna come underneath that front left leg. We're gonna pivot, hit a split lunge at the bottom. Give me one more, all the way in, all the way out. Come on, last eight, last six. Push it out, hold for three, for two, for one. Oh. Okay, all right, so the discs are done for right now. Light resistance band comes underneath that front standing foot. Left foot down, right foot back. Take it down, now I want you to hold at the bottom, find that my knee, get there, stay there. You got a 10 second hold to start this off. Roll shoulders out of the ears, square the hips. Good, you guys, now be careful that you aren't walking that tight rope. You got that toe, see how you can see both feet Hips, shoulders, everything is in line. Stack it in. In three, we start to pull. Row to the top in two. One, pull it up, pull up four. Three, two, hold. Take it down. Squeeze right here. Drop that knee, drop that shin towards the floor. Keep the chest up. Squeeze your inner thighs towards each other. Pull, pull. Draw into it, squeeze. Right back out. Whew. There we go. That left heel stays down. Now watch your left knee, it stays over the foot. You stand over that left leg. Take it out. Chest up, core tight. Now super lunge. I want you to just get the idea. Anytime I say a move with super in it, that means your entire body. We're asking it to work together right here. Squeeze it here. Good, you guys, you got just 10 seconds left. We're gonna hold it down, we're gonna row it out. Whew. Here we go. Take it down. In three, I want you to flip those hands underneath. In two, give me that serve the platter at the bottom. Push it out. Hold. Take it in. Pause right here. Good, you guys, 15 seconds. Whew. Take it back in, squeeze. Yes, you can right here for eight. There we go. We're gonna go back to that full range. You flip those hands back over. Hit that row. In three, two, one, let's go low. Low, maybe you kiss that knee to the floor, pull it up, squeeze. Stand into it right there, right back down. There we go. Whew. 
Here we go, here we go. Stand through. Good, do not let those left toes get too heavy right here. Keep back into that foot, keep that heel locked down. Last 10 seconds to move. We're gonna hold it all the way down. Hold in six, hold in three, two, 10 second hold right here. Fight for it, come on. Come on Tuesday, you did not get up, you did not make everything happen to be here right now to give up right now. We're gonna switch, you go to that medium resistance band, we're finishing with the mega donkey kick on the left. Yes you can, in three, two, one. All right, light or medium resistance band. I'm gonna switch it back to that medium resistance band. Comes around both those feet for me right here. We're on left leg, so meet me in that tabletop. Drop it down, kick it and open the left leg. Now push that heel back out and away. Slowly take it in, breathe, hold. Find that 90 degree, push it out, reach, pause. This is your final left leg exercise. So be careful, your body's gonna wanna start to tilt over to the right. Push heavier down through the left. Let the knee come outside of the left shoulder and then kick the heel back like you're pressing away that wall. Take it in, squeeze, use those abs up, come on. Push it out, four, Woo. three, two, pause, right back in. I know that left leg's wanting to drop, wanting to squeeze into this, but you came so far with it right here. This is that finish line for that left leg. The last chance, last opportunity, that eminent moment for that left leg, come on. Pull it up, squeeze into it, push through that heel. Good, you guys, you're still lifting through the nice outside edge of that leg. Turn, make sure that knee's not dropping to the floor, get it up. Point that shin like you're pointing it out to be parallel with the wall. Hold it halfway three, halfway two, one, one inch pushes, out one. In one hold, yes you can, take it out one. Take it in one hold for eight. Good, you guys, we switch this pulse. We're going straight up, open in three, two, one, open, close, Woo. squeeze, close, okay, let it shake, come on, you got just 10, you're pulling open, lift that knee, back full range, in three, two, one, go full range, full range, give me 20 seconds of full range, 20 seconds to move, come on, lock it in right here, pull it, pull it out, last 10, Good, you guys, do not let it drop, stay here. Give me one more with everything you got for six. We take that medium resistance band around the legs, tailbone, bicep, curl in three, two, one. Okay, so take that band, just slide it up so that it's behind the knees right here. Tailbone, bicep, curl. Hold, hover, squeeze up those biceps. Slowly take those arms out and away. That left leg is done, how good does that feel? Now, adjusting here, you can use those hand weights if you got it. Now, level one, place the feet down. Hold up nice and tall, focus into those arms right here. Level two, you wanna add a little bit of core, a little bit of balance shot. You can always balance one at a time while you build that core strength, that stability. Our balance all comes from that center right here, that focus, when you practice balance, that core, that coordination, those are all skills that help us in everything we do outside of what we're doing right here. Good, you guys, right here. I always like to say, toning that body is only part of it. When you work out, when you build up that immune system, when you build up that endurance, everything right here. It shows up that strength. We're able to do more. We're able to perform and show up stronger for everyone around us. You got 10 seconds, come on. Keep those biceps. I know they're already starting to shake. We're gonna flip it over. We hit that row, flip those hands. In three, two, let's go. Get an overhand grip onto that. Take a wide grip. Now pull, elbow squeeze. Slowly take it right back out. So again, you can plant the feet down. Pull through the back, squeeze. I want you to pinch those shoulder blades together. Reach, take the shoulders up. Feel how you're still heavy in the front of the shoulders as they straighten. Then pull, squeeze through that back. Good, try to maybe even sit it a little bit lower. 
hold into it. Right here, you're gonna find that core challenge where it's almost like those feet are being pulled back to you. Take your gaze up to the corner of the ceiling. Get the neck long. You give me 20 seconds right here. Back to that four count, pull it back for four. Three, two, hold, inhale. Reach it right back out, stop there. Exhale, pull it back. Whew. Squeeze, take it right back out. Good, you guys. You got this right here, give me two more. Two more, wherever you are. Pull, take it out. There you, last one, last one, come on. Pull, pull, squeeze. We're gonna take that off of those legs. We take it into that tailbone, angel in three, two, one, okay. All right, take that band. Plant the feet if that's your option. Grab the outsides of those bands or grab those hammocks. Pull out, open, squeeze with this right here. So. Yes, still into the back, but feel the difference. We're going down into those lats now. So now we're using that lat right here to pull back and down towards this here. I like to still hit that float hover. You want to up it, give me that straight leg lift. Come back to that tailbone right here. Tailbone angel, you fly it out. Come on, pull it back, squeeze. Hold, take it back, reach. You can always plant those feet, just keep them there. That's perfect, but I want you to start to feel that back flex. I want you to start to feel that work come in. Come on, pull, squeeze, take it out. Woo, there we go. Reach, hold, take it in. There we go, right here, push, breathe. You got 10. Woo, we're gonna come up onto those knees. Starting with that sexy back on the left. On the left, in three, two, one. Okay, come on forward. Take both hands into that band right here. Take the left elbow up, now kick back. It's like a single tricep kick back, but make sure. See how my palm is facing in. Lead with the back of the hand up. Roll the shoulders out of the ears, keep the elbow tall, keep your abs up and away. Flat tailbone, flat spine. Right here, squeeze it in. And stop right there. Good, you guys, we're gonna go ahead, hit that. You got just your last three upper body movements right here. We're hitting that upper body pretty strong right here too, stay. Squeeze it up and in. Breathe, hover, stop the fingertips towards the floor. Pull it up, reach long. Good, you guys. It's just 30 seconds right here. Whew, take it down. Breathe, squeeze it out, good. All right, we're splitting up that newspaper. We're gonna come and we're gonna hit that newspaper for 30 seconds before we alternate to that sexy back on the right side. I want your elbows to come into the side of the body. Open up like you're reading that newspaper in three, one more, in two, one, let's go. Elbows in, now open through those shoulders. Woo. You feel that on the left, let's go. Squeeze it out, pull. Slowly take it right back in, stop, hold. There you go. Nice, you guys, pull all the way back. Reach into it, I know those shoulders are shaking. I know everything in that body. Working into this here, pull, take it back. Breathe, stop there, take it right back out, come on. Whew. You got this right here. Do not be shy with that shake. Go for that shake, go for that reach. One more, all the way out, hold for four, hold for three, sexy back on the right in three, two, one. Left arm comes across the core, right elbow up, kick it back. Squeeze, slowly take it right back down. Make that L shape, make that 90 degree. Push it out and away. Take it down. Stop the hand before it comes under the elbows. Reach, reach back, squeeze. Good, you guys, hold it nice and tight right here. So, you aren't kicking out to the side. You're trying to kick straight behind that shoulder. Hold it up, get that core, lift it. Anytime you drop that chest, you're using your abs up and in. Squeeze, pull back through the arm, pull forward. Three. Two, slowly take it right back down, come on. Shake it out right here, come on. Yes, you can. You got six. One more, all the way out, all the way back. We finish with that newspaper. Take it in in three, two, one, open. 30 seconds right here, come on. Five for it, push it out, go reach. Reach, hold, take it in. Squeeze, squeeze, pause right there. All right, now that we already have that medium resistance band, Guess what, we're gonna go into that right leg. 
We're going to start it with that mega donkey kick. So we're going to run everything we ran on the left, just in that opposite direction. Change it up, you know, change of scenery. Little pushes right here. The challenge is going to be the same. It's going to be the same movements, the same work. We just run that up in reverse. Hold it out in four. Okay, hold. Tuesday right there for three. Take it around the feet in two, one. Okay, band goes around the feet. Find that tabletop position right here. Make a donkey onto the right in three, in two. Take it up, push it back, go. Reach. How strong does that right leg feel right here? You're just starting out. I love when we kind of alternate switching what one we run first with because I know by the time we got to this mega donkey kick on the left, our body was tired, it was fatigued right here. So this is where you really, really get a start, set the tone. Do not let that knee drop, keep it up. Squeeze into it, take it out, kick into it. Those abs are holding strong, pushing out and away from the floor. Pull your belly button back and in. Kick the heel out, out, stop there, take it right back down. I want you to draw a straight line to the floor from your belly button. Take that gaze, a foot in front of those fingertips, Reach the crown of the head long, scoop the abs in. Anchor down through that right hand. I want you to feel like your right palm is heavier into the floor. Push it out. Never locking out that right leg. Good, you guys, you got 15 seconds. Left onto that full range before we hold it in halfway. Get ready, here we go. In six, Whew. hold it in. In three, two, hold it halfway. Little inches, out an inch. In an inch, let's go. Out an inch. In an inch, come on. Fight for it, squeeze into it for four. We get ready in three, lift it up. Squeeze into that back pocket in two, one. Take it up an inch, Whew. down an inch, let's go. Take it up, squeeze it down. I know that fight is already coming into that right leg. Breathe it out. You got four, back to full range. Three, two, one. Final 30 seconds of that full range. Push it, push it. Reach it, take it in, in, in. Squeeze right back out. Drive, Whew. Push it out, flex that left heel. You got 10 seconds, come on. Give me even more. We're gonna find that light resistance, fam. We got that super lunge. Right foot forward, right foot comes into that band. Hands come on the other side of it. Grab those hand weights if you don't got it in three. One more, one more for two. One, okay, that shake is already in. Take that light resistance band, pop it. Underneath that front standing foot, take the left one back, drop it down, hold it there. Remember, we're starting with that 10 second hold. Shoulders out of the ears, core tight, hip square. Adjust that grip onto that band so that you feel that even tension right and left. Shoulders out of the ears. Start to rise, press through it. All the weights in that right foot, pull, pull, squeeze. Good, you guys, it's that extra credit for that upper body. Remember, I said super lunge. That means full body activation. Abs, we gotta get that heart rate up. Take it down, breathe. You're using those slow, controlled resistance muscles right here. If you let momentum come into play, it's actually gonna make it easier for what we're trying to accomplish right now. Right now, what we're trying to accomplish is no momentum. Just asking every resistance muscle to work in control. That pace, that tempo, that depth. Reaching, it's a balanced position at the bottom. Remember, you need to be able to see that left foot. Don't hide it behind that right ankle. There we go. 15 seconds left of this full range right here. One more all the way to the top all the way back down, we're gonna meet at the bottom, we're gonna flip that grip. Here we go, take it down in four. In three, two, hold, serve it out. Serve the platter, take it in. Squeeze, hold, there we go, reach, reach. Don't let that left toe become heavy. Remember that left leg's already been worked. It's all about the right side right here. I know you're fighting for it, come on. Push into it, last eight, stay with this. Because you guys, we're going to flip those hands back over. Final 30 seconds of full range in six. Whoo, flip it. In three, two, down first, down first. Reach for it, hold. Now slowly climb it up four. Three, 
two, pause there, right back down. Square it out, breathe it out. Hold, hover, push it up, go drive, drive. Stand through that right foot. I want you to feel like you're trying to break that band by pressing your foot so hard through it right here. One more, all the way up, all the way down, meet me at the bottom. Come on, pull it down right here. Yeah, we feel that right leg, here we go. Last six, Whew, find that heavy resistance band. We're going skating in three, two, one. All right, slide that heavy resistance band on. It's that one big pushing movement for me right here where we're using that heavy resistance. Left foot this time comes onto that disc. Right foot onto the floor, left on the disc. Drop it down, push it out. Hold, try to get that transition, get there, move right away so that we never take the tension, we never take the work off of the isolated leg. So right now it's that right leg that's pushing out. Reach, stack over it. Right foot down, left foot is onto that disc right here. Push it, sit low, push it out. Keep that left knee pointed over the second, third toe and keep it outside of the left hip. Whew, you feel that fight? That push right here. My right leg is saying, hi, good morning, how are you? <laughs> Hang with this here, abs are in nice and tight. Good, so careful to not let that knee come in front of that toe. Sit it back in that chair, push it out. Drive, take it back in, pull, scoop the abs in. Let's go, breathe it out, out. Reach, stop there, take it back in, little inches, come on. Sit it even lower, Whew. Pushing into it right here. Are you ready? Two inches, hold it halfway, let's go. Halfway hold for me in three. Two, hold it there, two inches, down an inch. Out one, hold. Down an inch. Out two, hold, just those two. In one, in two. Sit even lower, get that chest tall. I want you to look four to six feet in front of you. Get that neck long. Put your tailbone down behind you, so it's in a straight line. Abs are scooped up and in. You're pushing in, feel the anchor down through the outside of that right foot. Last six. Whew. Hang into it here. We go full range. Yes, you can. Remember, this is your only static movement that is into that right leg where we're just gonna hold full range in three, two, one. Fight for it. Okay. Here we go. I'm right here with you, Tuesday. Come on. This is the time that you put in for that child's pose at the end right here. This is where I need you to remember. This is where you're gonna think back to. That point, it would have been easier to do less but you gave your body that challenge. You set your mind to it. Strong minds, strong bodies. Last 10 seconds, all the way in, all the way out. Come on, I want your lowest. Drop it down, drop it down, out, hold. Take it in for four. We ditch that band. Escalator, three, two, one. Final leg exercise. Kick off that band, step that right foot forward, drop it right, back down, let's go. Take it low, low, hold. Now square it off, drag through that right heel, pull it underneath you, pull it up, squeeze, stop there. Take it down, breathe, square the hips, pull, hold, that right foot is anchored down. You're dragging, I want you to feel the hamstring, feel it pull underneath, hold, take it down. Good, you guys, I did not forget about those inner thighs. We're gonna hit them, we're just gonna finish with them because we're gonna use both those discs to go into those obliques. Hang into this here, breathe it out. Stay low, pull it up. Woo. Squeeze into it right here. There you go, you got it, you got it. This is where I want you to just push everything into that right leg, come on. Fight for it, stay with it. Hold it down, we got those three inches, let's go. Take it in three, two, one. Up an inch hold. Up two, pause. Up three, stop there. Okay. Can you feel those? Can you feel that little shake? That little push? This is here. Drive through it. 10 seconds on these three inches. We're gonna go back to that full range. Reach it out. Let's go. In three, two, down first. Down first, climb through. Whoo, there you go. All right, Tuesday, sink it low, go low all the way down, kick that foot as far as away as you possibly can, send it. Now drag through that heel, pull it back and underneath. 
Send those arms if you want that added challenge. Reach it out. Two more all the way up and down. Come on. Bring it up, squeeze. Take it down. Four, three, two, that's one. One more right here. We're gonna hang out at the bottom. Those last 30 seconds, you take it all the way down. Hold it low. Three on that moonwalker, let's go. Take it in. Two, three, hold, drop it down. One, push it out for four. Whew, three, two, hold, drop it down. One, come on, two more. Okay, it's shaking. Everything is going for this right here. Reach it out, last one, last one, pull it in. Pull it in, hold for five. Send it out slow, slow, climb it up so slow. You find that second disc in three, in two, one, standing inner thighs. All right, last piece of work onto those low bodies. We're going to finish class with those obliques. Squeeze it up and in, pull it, reach. Take it out from there, reach it out. Whew. Squeeze it up and in. Find that little spot onto in that sweet spot. Remember, you can do single side. This is your 60 second reset where you're still challenging those inner thighs. We're still challenging those low body. But because that chest is up so tall, we get to take those deep breaths in. <sighs> Exhale, squeeze. Woo. Try to take the momentum out of it. I know it's difficult. I know it's a funky one, but it's pulling, squeezing through the inside. Squeeze those adductors back together. Take it out. Final 15 seconds. Because you guys are oblique. We're going right and left the whole time. You meet me down. Whew. We're going single leg, dancing bear. Give me one more, pull it up in three. Take those hands down to a plank in two, one. Take it down. Both feet stay onto those discs. Toes up. Here we go. Alternating side. Single leg dancing bear. First 30 seconds. You're going right to left. Take it out. Squeeze. Pull. Drag. Take it out. Reach. There we go. Good, you guys. All right. Second 30 seconds. We're gonna take both those feet together. Otherwise you stay right here, level one. Here we go. Dancing bear, both feet together on one disc. Squeeze those inner thighs. Three, two, let's go. Pull it in, pull it in. All right, guys. We got three oblique exercises. This is that first one. We're warming up each side of that body right here. Reach it out. Ooh. Pull it back and squeeze. Squeeze, hold. Take it out. Reach. Breathe, there you go. Good, you guys, 15 seconds, come on. Hang into it. Hold, switch it up. Pull it in, remember you can always go to those single legs. Lock it in right here for 10. Whew. One more. Good, you guys, we flip it over. Lying onto that back, we're going soul train. Both feet on those discs in three, two, one. Okay, here you go. Flat onto that back. I want you to take yourself, sit into that tailbone right here. Sit it down. Place both feet onto those discs right here. This is why I fold my yoga mat in half usually. <laughs> we're alternating right to left. You guys promise yourself 45 minutes. You do not give up right here. Squeeze, twist, take it back for four, three, two, hold, take it back. Now you're dragging against those discs. Make sure there's a little bit of a pull where you actually are pulling, pushing down through that heel, alternating right to left right here. Squeeze, hold, you wanna add more? Take it up, twist. The second you elevate those hands, look through them. Take that gaze up. Squeeze, rotate through. Woo. Opposite elbow, opposite knee. Here we go, you got this here. Hang on to it, don't hold that breath. Inhale in through center. Exhale, squeeze it up. Good, you guys, you're here. 
All right. We finished class. You got a plank combo for me here. We're gonna go ahead. Whew. Meet me on the right. Single arm plank. Right side down. In three, two, one. We're here. Final push, you guys. You give me 30 seconds each side. Take it up. Hold. Squeeze. We're gonna go through the middle. So this is it. Final two minutes of class. Hold that oblique up. Squeeze into it. Push away from that hand through the floor. If you need to do this off the forearms, that's your option. But reach the body long. Take it up. I want you to imagine pushing those hands opposite direction. Squeeze it up. Good, you guys. Lift it up even a little higher. Scoop up into that right oblique as much as you can. Last six. You're going to come through center. Hit that center plank three. In two. In one right here. Hip dips right and left. Go right. Take it up center. Go left. Take it up center. Right here. Good, you guys. 15 seconds. Right to left. Center it out. That left arm's coming down. Open up to that plank. In three. In two. In one right here. Open it up. This time left forearm or left hand is down. Right side up. Reach into it right here. Reach opposite directions. Hold it. I know that challenge out balance is right here. You got less than 60 seconds with me before that child's pose. Come on. We started three after. We're finishing three after. Hang it to it. Pull those abs up. Push away. 15 seconds. Let's go. Lift up a little higher. Squeeze the body a little tighter. Hold into it. Squeeze those inner thighs. Squeeze your glutes. Pull the hips almost forward as you lift up. Cinch into that left oblique. For six. Get center in that plank in three, two, one. All right, here we go. Just hold, hold right here. Hit that form, hit that pace of that breath. 30 seconds to breathe, 30 seconds just to let that body show you everything it's giving yourself right here. You gave yourself 45 minutes. That means you finished to the end of it. Let's go. Last 15. Squeeze into it. Reach the body even a little longer. Pull the abs in. Pull the core tight. Come on. Don't let those hips sag. Scoop it up. Pull. Like someone just punched you in the gut. Pull it in. Last eight. Breathe it out. All you're going to have is that child's pose for me. In three. In two. In one. Take it down. Breathe it out. Whew. Tuesday. Beautiful. Good job, you guys. Thank you so much. Let's come on up and stretch it out. Hey, guys. Oh, I love, love, love getting to start my mornings with you guys. That one got a little sweaty. <laughs> All right, take that right before I give it that lunge. Oh, I'm moving into this right here, little drops. Just moving. Oh. So sometimes as we work into this right here. So I'm working on finishing up that stretch video that I did with stretch. Just have some editing, you know, some to make it pretty and whatnot. But one thing I love, and I, a lot of the times I forget about, is that kind of dynamic stretching where you're not just holding into something, but you're really kind of opening up, moving through it right here. So just taking that same thing. All right, here we go. We're gonna go ahead and take it back into that stretch. You guys got questions, anything, need a modification, have a move that like I ran and you weren't specifically feeling it. Just rotate it through. Oh. You guys are awesome. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh gosh. Dude, my abs in the beginning, those ankle weights are the most deceiving things in the entire world. I'm like, oh, that looks easy. My abs are shaking. Okay. Pull it into this right here. All right, go ahead and pull it back. Give it that, that's, I got a question. How much should we donate? Oh, guys, um, honestly, it's totally up to you, your space, and what you feel is okay for you. I have no number. I know everybody has got a lot going on. So there isn't a number nor probably will there be one during this quarantine and everything time. As we move forward into stuff, 
being able to continue to do this after everything, that's something I'll kind of address maybe at that point. But right now, really, honestly, I just appreciate you guys being here. When you guys donate and support, it's really just kind of a godsend. You guys are allowing me to keep teaching and doing what I love. So, yeah. <laughs> there you go. Oh, stretching into it right here. Oh, ooh, that's hip so. So, I hope you guys have an awesome Tuesday. Today is the um, last day for that little competition, for that little challenge. So, if you guys have tagged those three workouts, pull it on back. Take it back, stretch. So, I know a lot of you guys have been doing it, tagging it. I'm so excited. I'm so excited to be able to give someone um, five classes to a studio. It's just, oh, I can't wait to be back and like hug people. <laughs> you know, I, I'm going to cry every class for at least a week <laughs> when we're back and out of here, but I'll be excited. Okay, take it on back. Stretch it back. Pull it one more. Uh, uh, do I have PayPal? I do have a PayPal. Um, if if PayPal works better for you guys with any point like that, um, I think I can link it into my new little like drop down link tree thing. However, uh, shoot me a DM and I have, I think it's just under Megan Lyon. Um, that's kind of a bright side of being, my family's from Holland and it's L-E-I-J-E-N, um, technically Lyon, but uh, you know, Ellis Island decided to make it a Y. So there's really just my family. <laughs> um, that has that there. So most usernames, if you search Layin with Megan, I'm the only one. All right, take the hands all the way up. Reach it up and over, lay it down. Whew. Breathe out, stretch it out, slowly rolling up one vertebrae at a time. Breathe in that energy. Oh, you guys are phenomenal. Take it, name it, just take a second before you leave your space and just like feel what do you feel? Like, what is it that you just gifted yourself? And like, how do you embrace that? And then just go love it and share it with others. And you guys give mean the world to me. And I will see you soon.